Hey guys, Tony Hayes here, and we got a brand new tool, and this one is really good. It's called Viral Content Pilot. And basically, you can turn any content into a lead magnet. That can be your content or anybody else's content. Basically, we just turn them into uh, lead magnets in seconds, okay? It takes less than one minute to do. And with this, you can build your email list on autopilot with content that you already have or content that you want to share from other people. That can be very, very good as well for sharing content that is trending, anything to do with algorithm changes for, for search engine optimization, for example, or case studies being, being shared by people on uh, places like YouTube or even on Twitter, etc. as well, okay? The main benefit of this, it, in my opinion, is that we can capture real email addresses with Google authorization. That means you don't get any fake emails. And it's one of the fastest and easiest ways for you to be able to go and build an email list that is good for affiliate marketing. So if you are doing affiliate marketing or you want to do affiliate marketing and you just need to know how to build a list, this is a great way to be able to do it because you can put these links anywhere. You can put them on social media posts. You can put them on blog posts. Um, Parasite SEO articles, you can put them onto YouTube descriptions, everywhere and anywhere you can put these links, okay? When people click on the link, the Google authorization will open up and then you collect an email and then you can redirect them to the destination. That's the main way that I'm going to be using this, but we also have an option where we can share other people's content with a CTA banner, a call to action banner, okay? But that's an extra step and that might not convert just as well, but I put both options in here. So let's go and have a look how to set up a campaign. It is very quick, it is very easy to be able to do, okay? So you can see down here, I've got a couple of test campaigns uh, in this account and you can see that we have got as well some analytics in here. I'll talk about that in just a few minutes, but first, you got an option here. What would you like to do? Here we can create a direct call to action campaign without any CTA banners, without any call to action banners. Okay. That is really important because we are skipping a step where people can make a decision. Okay. This one is an old strategy that still works well, where you sh share other people's content or even your own content, but you have to put a call to action banner that will pop up when people um, click to go through to the content, okay? That's done via iframe, which has some restrictions. With the first option, we do not have any restrictions. Now, what you're seeing here right now is the pro version, okay? The core version will only have the content sharing with call to action banners. The pro version gives you the option where you can just bypass that completely, go straight to the call to action, so let's go and set up a campaign with this because this is the main event for as far as this tool is concerned. Okay, so I'll click on that. Then I will click on go to my dashboard. Okay, it's very, very easy setup. I'm going to give this a name. I'm going to call this one Viral Content Pilot. I'll put trial. I don't actually have any trial for it, but I'll put it in here. And then we have to put in a URL. Okay, so I'm just going to put in here. Let's just see. AnthonyHays.me viral content pilot. Okay, make sure I've got everything typed in here properly. I always do typos. Okay, now we're going to give you access to an email autoresponder system. It's called Kirim. I bought agency license on AppSumo um, a couple of years ago. Let me tell you, it's a very, very high quality autoresponder service. Okay, the benefits of it are that you will never get charged any fees for monthly um, usage. Okay, you will never get charged any fees by number of subscribers. I'm going to give you 25,000 email credits as well which is the only way that they make money by the amount of emails that you send. But here's what's really important is you can use that to collect your emails. Okay, so if you don't have an autoresponder system, you don't have to go and pay AWeber 
or any other company, you can use the Kirim account I'm going to give you. It's perfectly good. And it's also got some extra tools like referral campaigns and stuff like that. And use it just for setting up your autoresponder. I will do a video on that showing you how to do that. And basically what you can do is collect the emails. Okay. You tell it, tell the cam, you tell the campaign settings where you want, uh, which list you want to add it to. And if you have got an autoresponder sequence set up here, then it's going to send that autoresponder sequence. And you can simply copy and paste the email or export the email list that you've got and put it into um, any other autoresponder. So if, if you are using GetResponse or Aweber or any of those kind of um, email platforms, you can just simply import those at that particular point, okay? But the advantage is with Kirin, no monthly costs, unlimited subscribers, it's good enough with the 25,000 credits to do your autoresponder sequences and very, very comfortably so that you're building up reputation for the email that you're going to be using. I'll cover that in more detail later. Now, next, what we want to do here is add a countdown timer. Okay. So this is going to show on the Google authorization page, which I'll show you in just a second. Keep this very, very short. You can see I haven't put hours or days or anything in here. It has to be, um, a very, very short period of time. We don't want people to have to think to make a decision. You want to urge them, prompt them to be able to make that decision to give you their email, okay, or to subscribe. And here we're going to put in um, a call to action generator, okay. We're also going to add an extra pattern here where we can add a hook, um, which is going to be um, four different variations, okay. So four different variations of a compelling hook and those hooks will be based on things like um formal which is fear of missing out and scarcity and urgency that kind of stuff okay that would be like a mini headline and then the call to action and then it's going to have um the google authorization button okay you'll see what that looks like in just a second so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to take from here some text that i did before Okay, and I'll come back and I'll put this into the CTA generator and I will click on generate CTA variations. Now, all four of these are going to be used. Okay, why? Because we're doing some A-B testing or split testing, as I call it. Okay, you can choose not to put all four if you want, but just leave it because it's going to tell you which one is working best. We're going to have the same as well for this sort of headline, which are going to be hook based headlines. Okay. And that's all we need to do to set up a campaign. Now, if I'm setting up this campaign without recording a video, it's going to take me less than one minute, okay? And we go straight to the call to action with this stuff, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on launch the campaign. And that has been created now. And now you can see down here, um, viral content pilot, okay? So I'm just going to click here for preview. Okay, now you can see we've got our call to action. We got a little countdown timer and subscribe to continue. I'm going to click on this. Just pull this over here. I'm going to authorize from my Google account. And then it's authenticating. Once it's authenticated, it's going to redirect. And there we go. We go to whatever page you want to send them to. So if you were going to give them a free um, PDF or a free software, or a free custom GPT, you would just send them straight there. But look what's happened in the meantime, is when I go into my email list, that email has been added into my email list, and that's been added into my Kirim account as well. And if I've got an autoresponder sequence set up in there, which only takes about 10 minutes to do, okay, I'll give you templates for that, then it started to send the access with um, an autoresponder sequence, okay? Now, I've got a four-part autoresponder sequence that I use and, and I have used in the past to turn cold leads into buyers, okay? There's a specific way that we do that sequence of four emails. I will include the video on how that is done. It's very, very important. Now, you've seen how quick and easy this is to set up. You can put these links anywhere. And if I'm not mistaken, there are some ad platforms that we can use these links in, okay? These links we can add into some ad platforms. If I can back over um, into my dashboard over here. 
okay? I can just copy the link from here, and that link I can put anywhere, okay? If we're able to use this in ad platforms, which I'm going to te um, test tomorrow, then that is really good because that can accelerate your list building, especially if you're doing affiliate marketing and you want to build an affiliate marketing list because you can give people um, content or a giveaway that is based around affiliate marketing so you know that you're targeting properly. Put it in the right places. It can be in communities. It can be in groups, in your blog posts, in YouTube descriptions. can be anywhere you want and also in some ad platforms and you can accelerate your email list building, okay? Very powerful tool, very simple tool, but really, really powerful. This is one of my favorite tools that we have built, okay? It needs a little bit more polishing. Um, we are still working on that, and there's more to come as well. We, have, we are not stopping there. I want to add in the option, for example, to put SMS opt-in boxes, which can be great if you want to get people to register for webinars. And it doesn't have to be your webinar. You can promote other people's um, products via evergreen webinars that they have already recorded and you can collect their telephone number, you can collect their email. And if you've got the telephone number, do you know that it, it increases the webinar attendance rate by two times by having the SMS notifications, sending um, notifications to people where a webinar starts in one hour, for example, okay? And um, so there's more to come with Viral Content Pilot. This is just the first version, okay? And we've rebuilt it one time already. We created the first version. We thought, let's scrap it, let's do it again so that we get this just right. I'm using this as well. I built it for me to use. I'm going to use this for building email lists um, for affiliate marketing. That's what I'm building this for, and I know this is going to work. It is definitely going to work really, really well um, because we have just cut out all the crap in between things like landing pages, things like CTA banners, etc., with the pro version, okay? And that makes it super easy to be able to collect people's email addresses and be able to send them autoresponder sequences that build the know, like, and trust. And there's more to come, okay? There is definitely more to come, and it will be coming um, quite quickly as well after we release this tool, okay? So if you want to get a hold of this tool, then keep an eye out for your emails and you'll be able to get hold of Viral Content Pilot very, very quickly, very soon. Thanks.